Blessings to you good looking people on YouTube and on Facebook. Yes, I did say good looking because if you ain't good looking to me, you be good looking to your own self. I don't need nobody to tell me I'm good looking. I'm good looking all by myself. And that's what the Bible talks about. He said, delight yourself in the who? In the Lord. And that's what we're going to be talking about today. So that's why you get up feeling good and knowing that God made you and he made you perfect just for you. Nobody have your eyes. Look at the mind. Nobody have your nose, my God. Nobody have your lips. Nobody have your ears. God took his time to make you, and that's why you are beautiful to if no one else. You're beautiful to God first and yourself second, and then who else worry about it? You don't care. My God, my I, I, I'm, I'm excited this morning because God got us up in our right mind, and I really feel really good this morning. And uh, I went to go see a good friend yesterday at the hospital. And I tell you, it was a line so long and I wasn't able to get in there. It was just too long. And they was asking all kinds of questions and where your mom lived at before she married your dad. And did she have two boyfriends uh, before she met your dad? And my God, and how much detergent you got at the house. They asked you all kinds of questions. So, you know, I just turned around and I cut up out of there. And uh, I called a person and told her just too much going on. Uh, I don't want them all in my business like that. So um, just to turn the page here, we're going to talk about a very good uh, subject here today. We're going to talk out of the book of Psalms chapter 37, verse 3 and 4. And we have heard it so much, and I, my sister say it all the time. I think it's one of her favorite scriptures, but... I really just hit my heart this morning. I was like, Lord, what do you want me to give the people this morning? Basically, it just came up delight. I'm like, delight, delight, delight. And when I looked up and bam, there it was, Psalms 37, 3 and 4. It's amazing how God do me uh, in the morning when he want to give you a good word this morning. But I want to read that in your hearing so we can get started with this. Uh, just a good Wednesday word. Somebody say a good Wednesday word. And listen, I, I like coming on here talking to uh, the viewers that do watch. Please don't be selfish. Share this uh, message this, and you can go through my videos. I have a video uh, videos on YouTube. You can go to O.D. Diggins, that's lower cap, and just hit the big uh, circle od and go to videos and make sure you subscribe and like i said don't be selfish you may not like my tie you may not like me i don't know but you need to like the words that are coming out of my mouth because they're the word of god i'm not anything i'm just here just a messenger i'm no better than you no matter about my title as a pastor i still have to do everything you have to do god don't fly down in my bedroom in the morning six inches off the ground and, and trolls, trolls, no, I don't hear that. I have to hear from my inner being, my inner self, my person have to talk to me, connect it to God. Uh, sort of like you go to the mirror and say, I am stupid. I, I made a mistake. Mm, what do I need to pick up from the store? Mm, do I have butter at home? Whatever you're talking, that's your inner being. You're talking to yourself. And I think they used to say, well, as long as you talk to yourself, you don't answer. You need to answer yourself. Should I turn right or left? The sign, mm, maybe I better go left. Should I date him or not? Should I date her or not? You have to come up with some decisions that you need to make, and they be serious uh, decisions that you need to make in your life. But this scripture right here helps me because it tells you the only thing you need to do is delight yourself in the Lord. Not Pookie and Ray Ray Nim, not your girlfriend, not your boyfriend, not your mama, excuse me, not your dad, not your siblings, not your cousins, not your co-workers, but delight yourself in the Lord. Delight yourself mean, uh, the word delight just mean please greatly. Please greatly. It starts off with delight means please greatly. I Man, I just thank God for you. And, uh, and that's what you have to do with the Lord. Lord, I just thank you. Thank you for you gave me breath this morning and you gave breath in my body this morning. I wasn't woke up with no alarm and I wasn't plugged up into no, no wall. It was you by your grace and mercy. Got who I feel that thing got me up this morning in my right mind. I can move this morning. I can hear this morning. I can see this morning. I can smell this morning. Let me see. I can taste this morning. Why? 
God, that's good when you can do that this morning. Even when you can get up and just smile. I tell you what you do today. Do a little test on yourself. See who going to knock you off your mark. See how tough you are. Can you go all day just smiling? I don't care if you run across Vera and she rolled her eyes and rolled her eyes at you. And you look at instead of you rolling your eyes back, you say, girl, I'm going to get some coffee in a minute. You want something from the machine? You know, talk to her. Come on, your boss, that's mean. Get over there. You know, don't leave your break until your, your, your break time. Get back in your air, talking to you like you're a little boy. You know, yes, you look at him and say, hey, George, you okay today, man? You watch that game and find out what he like. You know, you watch that football game the other night? Talk to him. Don't let nobody knock you off your mark. Don't let nobody see you, you sweat. Why? Because I delight myself in the Lord. And when I delight myself in the Lord, you can't give me heaven or hell. And you can't knock me off my point. My God, I feel like running this morning. Let me read this in your hearing because you're looking at me funny. Delight yourself in the Lord and he will give you the desires. Somebody said desires. The desires of who? Your heart. Ooh, that's good when you get the desires of your heart, you know, because we can love some stuff deep. We can love that alcohol. We can love them drugs. We can love them, that, that sex. We can love uh, uh, lying. We can love our attitudes. We can love our no good friends. We can love, my God, we can love a whole bunch of stuff that's no good for us. That milk and them pills and, and talking crazy and can't be told nothing. Busybody, all of that. He, we, he, we, he will give you the desires of your heart. And that's what you want. That's what you get. All what I just named. This verse is not only commands us to trust him. We need to trust the Lord that the Lord by re, be, reminds us the Lord, the Lord, but reminds us that finding delight in the Lord will also result in positive things coming your way. Wow. Wow. The Lord but reminds us that finding the light in the Lord will also result in positive things coming your way. When you work that positive, positive come back to you. Do that make sense? Man, that's good right there. Delight yourself in who? In the Lord. And you don't have to worry about no one else. Just delight yourself in him. Lord, I thank you this morning. Lord, I thank you for this pizza car. Lord, I thank you that I got food in the cabin. Lord, I thank you that I'm blessed. My husband is blessed. My wife is blessed. My children is blessed. My God, my co-workers is blessed. Yes, and even my enemies, I'm praying for them. My God, and when you start that day off like that, the devil in hell can't attack you. Why? Because you shielded. You got your breastplate on. You got your helmet. You, you, my God, you got your, your legs protected. My God. And reason God didn't never say that he had nothing on our back, because we not supposed to run. Face that demon, and that demon will flee. My God, put some Jesus on him, and he will flee. So delight yourself in who? In the Lord. Not Ray Ray and Pookie them. They ain't going to do you no good. They, they can't give you heaven or hell. Just delight yourself in the Lord. Isn't that good? Good Thursday little message today. I love you all out there. Be blessed today. And remember, if you use this word, pastor, see you on top. I love you all. Be blessed.